look, I know you don't want to answer people who are, have never done what you've accomplished. But we have investors who are saying, look, I'm in this thing. I, I know Siebel is bankable. I want to see right now, th this year, that he can't make a lot of money from me. Not well, bad. I think what we need to look at is the addressable market opportunity. Okay. And for me to throw this into a cash positive business in 90 days, which I could do, right. would, would be not in the best interest of the shareholders and not in the best interest of our customers. We have a clear path to profitability, uh, okay, in the next, you know, let's say, uh, six quarters, okay. where we basically reduce our marketing expenses from 29% of revenue to 11. Nobody spends 29% right. of, of revenue on marketing. Our R&D expenses to make established technology leadership have been 44% of revenue. Goodness, Jim, nobody spends 44% no, of revenue. No, I agree. I, I, you know, look, so I'm, we bring, we bring I am that more down of a devil's advocate level. on this one, Tom. You made, when I was a hedge fund manager, you made me so much money that to be dismissed the way the research is doing it is wrong. At the same time, I understand, and you understand, that the market is jumpy and jittery about companies that are not making money. And you and I know that that may be wrong at this time, but I also, and the sentiment is not completely crazy. No, Jim, and, and I don't want to, you, you know I have enormous respect for the markets and I have enormous respect for investors, but markets are pretty jittery right now. Right. And I think we're likely to have a bloodbath in the tax market in, in the next two years. I mean, you and I have seen this movie before. Right. Okay, and it's gonna get ugly out there. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.